and the FedEx form is alive once oh, again. Oh, yes. Tough floater by Robinson. Here's Martin taking it in and scoring. Got it up. Got it at the horn. Hit and a foul. Oh, he knocks down a cold-blooded three. The MVP chance filling out FedEx for him. First game of four today, the number eight seed, USF Bulls, taking on the number nine seed, the UConn Huskies. This is everything to me, uh, just like the, the friendships and the bonds that I've built throughout uh, UConn and throughout this conference, even with other teams. I just want to be a part of it one more time. And as a college player, you always want to play in, in March. Anything can happen. Adams. That's off the set. No, I was just out there having fun with my teammates, especially when it's just do or die. The UConn Huskies advance to move on to the quarterfinals. But anytime you have a player of Jalen Adams' caliber on your team, you always got a shot. We get set for game two of four today. And the first round as the number five seed, the hometown Memphis Tigers, take on the number 12 seed, Tulane Greenway. Another steal, and it's Martin again. Just when you think you have Jeremiah Martin contained, he does that. And the Memphis Tigers will be moving on. You know, I'm just enjoying every second, every moment of when we get ready to walk into the gym and just want to go home. I know I'm a scorer, so uh, making big shots is something that I can do. McMurray with 27 and 5 assists. SMU has a date with Cincinnati tomorrow night. The last of our quadruple header on day one in Memphis, Wichita State and East Carolina. The winner moves on to tomorrow's quarterfinal round. Everybody work for me. Everybody work for me. Nicely done by ECU, the freshman, Jaden Gardner, number one. We, we're here to handle business. You know, it's something that I'm used to. You know, I'm used to being in the conference tournament. I'm used to playing in the playoffs. I'm used to, you know, just being a Wichita State basketball player and winning makes me cherish the moments I have left. A thorough 40 minute beat down of East Carolina. He'll face Temple tomorrow. In the quarterfinals, the American Conference will be there. Ballin' ain't a thing to me. A senior from Houston, Texas, number 25, Robinson, The top seeded Houston Cougars, as they get set to take on ninth seeded Connecticut. Yeah, no, listen, that's a pack of wolves. Those guys, you know, that, that is a pack of wolves. The season for Connecticut ends at 16 and 17. The career for Jalen Adams ends with over 1,700 points. Win number 30. They haven't been able to say that in 35 years in Houston. Second quarterfinal of the day pits the four and five seeds, UCF and Memphis. Martin sets up Davenport. Baked it in, counted, and a foul away from the ball. We're talking about this, is that we don't want anyone hosting up a trophy in our gym. I mean, losing, losing never feels good in any situation. Uh, we wanted to leave here with a championship, and you know we didn't achieve that goal. So, uh, I mean, this, this loss, it, it hurts a lot.
SMU and Cincinnati. The winner on to the American semifinals tomorrow. Cincinnati has won 25 games this year. Why? Who's a Jim Cumberland? SMU. They've got that guy though. Jamal McMurray opens the scoring with a three for the second straight night. Cumberland's had a terrific half. Off to Jennifer, who's been perfect. Jimmy Witt is the most diverse player in the American. Jared Cumberland may be the best. It was a, it was a great experience. You know, we came out came out tonight and, and really fought hard and, and put ourselves in position to win a game. And you know, a few things happened during the game that didn't go our way. Cincinnati, the defending American Conference champion, will play tomorrow night with a chance to return to the title game. Last game of the night, the six and the three, Wichita State and Temple. Marcus McDuffie was playing like a man possessed, shooting the basketball, getting to the free throw line, and offensive rebounding like crazy. It's just me believing in myself and just, you know, putting this team on my back. Like I said, I'm the senior, you know, and I don't have many games left, you know, and, you know, this is towards the end. So, like I told you yesterday, I'm just cherishing the moments I'm here and just going, playing all out. Is. He's a tremendous guy, great player. I don't know where we would have been without him all year long. I think he, uh, or last four years, he's been a terrific guy to coach. But I, I'm grateful for having the opportunity to have coached him. American Athletic Conference Men's Basketball Championship Semifinals. And Jeremiah Martin is Jeremiah Martin. I mean, he's he's been phenomenal all year for us. Without him, where would we have been? Being here for four years, he'll, he'll go down as one of the better guards that we've had here. Here's a three by Harris. Long rebound, Harris. White knocked it away, and that'll do it. The Cougars survive as the top seed, and they're moving to the championship game. Um, just somebody that was loyal to the city, um, came out and played hard, got better every year. Just loyal, to be honest. I stayed home, could have done anything else, but I felt like this is where I wanted to you know, be and give my all to my city. I don't regret anything, you know, I just want to be remembered as someone who is always positive, always work super hard and never let anything get to me, you know, and, and who I am as a person. Today it's round three between Houston and Cincinnati for the American Athletic Conference Tournament Championship. Let's go, let's go, let's get the motors wrapped up. You know, you, sh you should want to play the best team. You know, that's what we're about at Cincinnati. And if you win the title, you should have to beat the best team to win the title. Yo, we here now, vision's clear now. Yo, it's my time, and it's near now. And I'm too strong, no fear now. You can feel it when the crowd starts to cheer now. I know they want to stop me, but they've been acting cocky. I'm the underdog. He has the last eight for Cincinnati. A 13-point start for the player of the year. The senior, the veteran, Galen Robinson. This guy is, as you call him, just a straight-up winner. In and out, tumble in the rebound. Hit it, and a foul! And I'm too strong, no fear now. You can feel it when the crowd starts to cheer now. Jared Cumberland. A tournament championship game record, 33 points. Well, for me, the hurt, you know, it's my last year. It's the only thing I haven't done in my career is win a conference tournament. So 
for me, it kind of it hurts different, but um, I know in the grand scheme of things, we had two goals we wanted to accomplish. Win conference and um, get to the NCAA tournament. Those two boxes are checked, so um, the sky's the limit for us. It's back to back for the Bearcats. A second consecutive American Athletic Conference Tournament Championship. We was very hungry. Uh, we was embarrassed the last time we played them at home, and we was just a hungry team. Just coming back to back champions meant a lot to me, and we accomplished a lot.